In this video, I'm going to show you the differences between a DVR and an MVR. This unit right here to the left is an MVR, it's a network video recorder, and this is a DVR. As you can see, on the DVR, you have multiple BNC inputs, and those represent the cameras that are going to be connected to it. That's where the cameras actually are going to be connected to it. On an MVR, you don't see that because everything is done through the network. Everything is IP, so uh, you can place these units everywhere on the network, and then as long as the cameras are within that network, or even uh, across networks, they are going to be able to reach the MVR and record to it. On a DVR, uh, the connection to the camera is a point-to-point -point connection, so you will use a cable like this. This is a regular BNC cable. One end goes to the DVR, and the other end will go to the camera. On uh, MVR, you will have uh, just a simple cable connections. One cable will be connected to your router. This is a wireless router, so you can see here. Uh, as long as the DVR is connected to uh, the one of the ports of the router, the only thing you got to do is connect your camera to that same router, and that's pretty much it. This particular camera is an IP uh, 2 megapixel dome, and the only thing you got to do is just connect this end to it, and if you don't have a PoE switch or a power over the Ethernet switch, you will need to provide power, 12 volt power supply. Normally, all of our cameras are PoE or power over the Ethernet capable, so the only thing you got to do is just connect a PoE switch into your router and you will be able to provide power to the camera very easily. That's uh, one of the benefits on, on an MVR uh, against a DVR. A DVR, you have to use a power supply per camera or you can run cables from the power supply to the cameras directly. On a DR, you don't. Everything is done uh, through the network. Everything is powered over the same cable if you have PoE switches. Uh, the color quality and the picture quality on an MVR is amazing. This it's megapixel quality and this is analog quality. And on a DVR, you'll have uh, up to D1 resolution, and uh, on a DV on an MVR, you will have up to 1080p or even more. So that's uh, one of the main differences between a DVR and an MVR. Again, an MVR can be placed anywhere. You can also have redundancy through the network. The only thing you got to do is just plug in another unit on the network and uh, set up to record the main MVR. Unlike DVRs, you have to run more cables to do any type of redundancy or have a, a device attached directly to it. Um, every connection to the DVR is a point-to-point -point connection through a BNC cable. And on an MVR, everything is done uh, through the network itself uh, using Ethernet uh, cable, Cat5 cable. And uh, qu uh, quality-wise, uh, they're both excellent uh, units, but quality of recording on a megapixel or an MVR is going to be higher than a regular uh, analog system or a DVR. I hope this has been informative to you, and thank you for watching.